Hi guys, today I'm going to do my wrap up for the month of February and my month was not as great as it was in January. I only read five books this month and I'm a little disappointed with that, but overall it's actually not that bad of a reading month for me. And with that said, let's get started. The first book I read this month was Seconds by Brian Lee O'Malley and this is a graphic novel. It follows Katie who worked in a restaurant and her life just isn't quite turning out the way that she wanted it to. She's not happy with the way things are at the moment and she comes across a way to start changing the way things happened and to help fix things and she just gets carried away. And I really enjoyed the story. I read it probably in about an hour. The artwork is really pretty and I really enjoyed the style and overall I really liked this book. The story is really weird and I wasn't quite sure what to do with that, but I did enjoy it. The next book I read was Slaughterhouse Five by Kurt Vonnegut, and this book is really weird. Um, it talks about aliens a little bit, and it's kind of confusing. The story felt very disjointed for me. It jumped around a lot, and it was really weird. I think I might enjoy it better if I read it again, but the first time through, I didn't really like it that much. And a couple of my friends were not very happy with me for that fact, but it just wasn't my cup of tea. The next book I read was The Secret Diary of Lizzie Bennet by Kate Rorick and Bernie Sue. And I've talked about this a bajillion times on this channel because I've bought it and started it and stuff. So for the last few videos, I have talked about this book, so I won't really say much about it, but I did really enjoy it when I finished it. There are things that are in this book that are not in the web series, but I thought that kind of added to it. And I know some of the reviews on Goodreads were saying that they didn't feel Lizzie's voice in this, and I definitely felt her voice there, but maybe that's just me. The next book I read is A Darker Shade of Magic by V.E. Schwab, and this book, it's amazing. I love it so much. I don't even know what to say about this book besides you should read it right now, and I don't know why you haven't picked it up already if you haven't, because it is flawless and I love it so so much. I gave it a full five stars because I love it that much. And the last book I read this month was The Perks of Being a Wallflower by Stephen Schwatsky and this book is definitely slower. I did try to read this a couple years ago and it was just really slow and I got maybe 20 pages in and put it down because I was like this book is not for me. And then the movie came out a couple years ago and I did see that and I really enjoyed the story and I meant to pick it back up shortly after I saw the movie and just never did. And then I found this copy of the book on Book Depository and it was really pretty and I felt like I was really going to enjoy the book so I went ahead and bought it and I did really enjoy it. I really connected with the main character of Charlie because he's a little bit awkward and he's shy and he doesn't really know how to act or respond bond to things and that was and still is me. I am very very shy and I don't know how to make friends. I honestly don't know how I have any in real life because I don't know how to make them. And so I just really related to Charlie in his awkwardness and him not knowing how to deal with people and what to do in situations because I am the same way. But I did really enjoy this book and I'm really glad I picked it up again and I'm very happy to have this one on my shelves. And like I said a while ago, I'm actually not really doing a TBR, even though I do have a TBR jar. So I don't really know what I'm going to be reading in the month of March, but right now I am reading Mrs. Queen Takes the Train by William Kuhn. At least I think that's how it's pronounced. Kuhn, maybe? Not really sure. Um, I'm not very far in, maybe like 20 pages. and. I'm not really sure what I think about it yet. It's just kind of starting to build the characters a little bit. So we'll see how this one goes. So if you've read any of the books I talked about in this video, leave me a comment down below telling me what you thought of those books. And I will see you next time. Bye!